Hi guys. So, I'm wearing my walkaway dress, which I love. Um, and somebody did make a lovely comment when I was out and about wearing it that it looked like something from Blue Banana, which is a, a big chain store that sells gothic tech clothing, if you don't know. But yeah, it is. It was a lovely comment. Um, I'm just trying to find my problem. So my problem is the fabric. And I don't know if you can see it from there, but it keeps coming away from the binding. It's just fraying like mad. So um, I've tried to make a few hasty repairs, but it's just not looking nice. So I might actually take the binding off and then put some like that hem tape on it and then put the binding back on. But that might be a bit tedious and soul destroying. So rather than do that, I'm going to make another one. Because why not? <laughs> um, and I've been on Stolston Mill's website and purchased some remnant fabric, which was really reasonably priced. And it means that I'm recycling fabric that would otherwise go to waste, which is lovely. So we have this with the crows and the bats. It might be well for you, isn't it? So I'm going to use that for the outside piece, the back piece and the skirt. Um, so and then this is going to be the grey piece that you can see here. Sorry, hit the mic. It's going to be the grey piece that you can see. And I'm trying to get hold of some um, contrasting bind bias binding. Um, I did order some, but I had to order two packs, and the packs were different colours, slightly different shades, and I was like, mm, can't use that. So <laughs> that is currently in the post on the way back to the Zella, and I'm hoping that they send me out two that are the same, because the colour was, the one colour was very beautiful, the other was a bit brown, so I'm hoping they don't send me the brownish one. If they do, I'll just buy somebody else. I need to find a fabric seller in Nottingham. I, I know where there is one but it's not a massive store, it's just got a little bit of fabric, it's got a little bit of yarn, it's got a little bit of this, a little bit of that. So yeah, my face needs sewing. Yeah. And this time I am going to add pockets. So this is from another um, sewing pattern. So I'm going to have to I think I'm just going to cut into the seat, into the side where I want the pocket and just attach it rather than having a whole seam just for that pocket. It might not work out that way, but that's how I'm thinking I'm going to do it. And then I'm going to put bias binding along the top of the pocket so it kind of contrasts so you see where the pocket is. That's my idea. We'll see if that works. So come along with me. We'll get the fabric cut out. And we'll get started. Okay, so all my pieces are cut out. So we've got the front, which we need to put some darts in next. And then we've got a skirt piece. And another skirt piece. Um a big skirt piece for the back because I want to do it slightly different to the pattern because I want to add pockets this time. So I'm hoping, just rip the pattern, um, that that will be the back. Yeah, and then we have two, two pieces towards the front and then in between those we'll pop the pockets. And this is the top to attach to the skirt which we need to put darts in and um, wait for it, wait for it, pockets, <laughs> okay, Oops. so I've got out all the pockets and they are going to go into the skirt, so first thing we'll do is the darts, then I'll attach the pockets and then we can start assembling the actual dress, I think.
Did I not film any of that? Oh my goodness. Okay. So I've just cut some <laughs> bits for button loops. I need one for the back, two for the front. So that's going to be that. And then I'm going to be putting in a little bit of trim on the front of the pocket openings. I'm going to hand sew that bit on. <sighs> but I'm going to sew the button loops on now and then we have to hang the dress and let the hem drop before we can do the hem so we'll come back and do the hem and that's ready Okay guys, so it's all finished, it looks great, the only thing I would like to do different is 
of the the pockets don't line up properly so I could do a bit better with that but other than that I'm really pleased with it. So I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you again soon. Bye!